Pop icon Cher has slashed out after her social media homage to the Queen made headlines for some wrong reasons. In today's video, we're going to discuss what exactly Cher called Queen Elizabeth. Stay tuned to find out. In a tweet that Cher shared in the wake of Queen Elizabeth's second demise, the pop icon seems to make a very tragic blunder by referring to the late monarch as a farmyard animal in her heartfelt statement. She tweeted, I am sad about the passing of Queen Elizabeth II. Had the honor of meeting her. I was in long line of people waiting to meet her. Yet when she got to me, she asked me pertinent questions and seemed genuinely interested in talking to me. I'm proud she was a cow. Happy, she had a great sense of humor. Social media users were shocked after Cher's tweet, with many wondering why the pop star had decided to use a cow emoji. One user tweeted, What does the cow or bull symbol mean in this statement? Someone else said, Cher accidentally shared the wrong emoji. A third user commented, Did Cher just call the queen a cow? Others wondered if the celebrity had really meant goat or greatest of all time. One user said, Cher casually calling Queen Lizzie a cow instead of a G-O-A-T. There are tears in my eyes. I can't. But now the pop icon has hit back, disclosing that she wasn't associating the late Queen Elizabeth II to a cow at all. It turns out Cher is just truly into star signs. She took to Twitter to clear the confusions up. She wrote on Twitter, Someone said I put a cow next to the queen. Meeting her was one of the highlights of my life. We are both Taurus. She also called out those who had claimed that she had referred to the queen as a cow. The pop star explained, I was saying how proud I was, while adding that some people just project their own hateful selves onto others. The goddess of pop then recalled how the queen was kind to her. She said that she was so nervous about Kurt seeing the royal that she practiced for an hour before meeting the monarch. Well, the queen is recognized to be a fan of cows having been seen on camera responding excitedly to cattle being paraded as part of her 90th birthday celebrations a few years back with a now viral clip showing her saying cows. If you're liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking this video. Now let's continue. Cher rose to fame with her 1965 song I Got You Babe and Dua Lipa also got her big breaks as a teenager signing with her Warner Music Group in 2015 when she was just 15 years old. That's before the multi-Grammy winner released her first single, New Love, in the same year. But as much as Cher and Lipa are multi-award winner artists in their own right, they are also from different eras. This is something a fan that Believe singer Cher commented on. The Twitter user referred to Dua Lipa as the Cher of our generations. Another user also retweeted the message along with the captions that read, So much truth in one tweet. The same fan tagged both singers in the tweet, provoking Oscar winner Cher to reply. Cher questioned the comment, writing, How many years are in a generation? The tweet shared by the original user included a video from the 2021 Grammy Awards, which saw Lipa looking strikingly similar to Cher in a sheer crystal-covered Versace dress. Many people also pointed out that it resembled one that Cher wore to the 1974 Academy Award ceremony. Speaking of the Versace design at the time, Dua Lipa said, Butterflies have had a lot of symbolisms for me this year, and it's really got a lot of symbolisms for Versace too. So it was really cool to get to come together and make something cute. There's no doubt that as well as the pair both being celebrated for their vocal talent, they are well known for their daring fashion choices too. Cher has been recognized to turn up to high-profile events in revealing looks like the sequin dress she wore to the 1987 Oscars. And similarly, on August 27, Lipa attended the wedding of fashion designer Simon Portes Jacquemus and Marco Maestri in the south of France, donning a gauzy number of designs by the husband. Her daring look also broke formal wedding guest conventions and conventions and boundary breaking is something that Cher is also remembered for. Diagnosed with dyslexia in adulthood, Cher finally realized she had so much trouble in school. The star said, it all fits together. In her autobiography, the first time Cher said, I couldn't read quickly enough to get all my homework done. Almost everything I learned, I had to learn by listening. My report cards always said that I was not living up to my potential. When Cher became a mother of two kids, she later realized that her son Chas Bono also battled with reading just like her. Taking her then 10-year-old son to a testing center, the expert also asked about Cher's experience with reading and writing as dyslexia can run in families. With more than 4 million followers, on the social media side, Cher has a big platform to advocate for more support and understanding of dyslexia.